Today, many politicians and other well-known people wear glasses. But no one knows the person who invented the first pair of spectacles. In 1266, Roger Bacon enlarged the letters in a book by placing a magnifying glass over them. But who was the first to think of wearing linces close to the eyes? In a 1352 portrait, Cardinal Hugo is depicted wearing glasses that consisted of two framed linces and two arms joined together and placed before the eyes. When the first printed books appeared, glasses became absolutely essential. Most craftsmen at the time worked in northern Italy and southern Germany. So by the 16th century, glasses were mainly produced in those regions. In 1629, King Charles I of England approved the charter of the Guild of Spectacle Makers. And in 1784, Benjamin Franklin invented bifocals, glasses with two types of lenses for different distances. Today, glasses not only help people read and see clearly, but are also used for many other purposes. We know that dark glasses protect the eyes from bright light and sunlight. Colored lenses are used for camouflage. Night aviators and photographers wear red lenses, while skiers, pilots, polar explorers, and mountaineers use glasses that absorb ultraviolet and infrared rays. Steelworkers wear glasses that block infrared radiation, and glassblowers use lenses that help them see better. So, which invention do you think will replace glasses in the future? Leave your answer in the comments below.